Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and today we're actually gonna do something a little bit different. Today we're gonna be doing little meme searches on Reddit. You know, I rarely ever use Reddit, to be honest. I barely ever touch it. I mean, now and then I use it as promotion for like my streams or YouTube videos sometimes. Sometimes, but not like extremely often. It's like every blue moon. But I honestly did want to look at some pretty funny memes. You know, because, you know, Reddit's all about, you know, making these hilarious memes that you never seen. I see too many memes on Facebook anyway, so maybe they'll have some new ones I haven't seen before. But with that said, let's get into uh, words. But let me go ahead and restart that over. With that said, let's get into it. When you are home alone playing horror games and suddenly hear weird noises from your background. Mom, come pick me up. I'm scared. <laughs> okay, okay. This is actually relatable if you're like playing horror games by yourself and you're the only person in the house as a kid, for sure. Now, this time, I when I play horror games alone, it's just like, whatever. It's just like, I enjoy actually being jump scared most of the time. It's like, if you can get me, you got me, and I'll admit it. But as a kid, that... That shit was traumatizing, especially with like the old Slender games, like, oh boy, like those would get everybody. When you keep dying on a single boss. Thomas has seen enough bullshit. Oh, yeah, then you gotta bring out the big guns. You, tr you try to beat it the nice way, then you gotta, you gotta sort of bring out that big cheesy weapon, you know? But then again, <laughs> I, I gotta say, I've been stuck on a couple of bosses like that, and, you know, I try to beat it with one sword or one new weapon that I've, you know, just got, and try to learn that, but then when a boss starts BSing me, I'm just like, no, nope, I'm done. I gotta I got bring out the good spicy weapon that I always use and beat all the other bosses with, screw that. There is no new weapons for me, apparently. Pro gamers in the game. Pro gamers in person. Why do I feel personally attacked? Uh, I, I don't know why I feel personally attacked. Okay. What kind of blasphemy is this? Uh, oh, not only that, that's his side scope. Uh, that's... <laughs> ESRB when a game has actual gambling designed to target children and teens. ESRB when a <laughs> game has <laughs> fuck in the dialogue. Okay, I heard about this. This is the whole NBA situation. Yeah, I don't really play too many like uh, sports games and all that, but what I heard is it's actually pretty damn bad. But I'm not gonna take it too far like everybody else is, just because my homie has already told me that gambling was already in the other game before this one, and it's just now becoming like a whole topic, which is kind of weird. And it. And to be honest, they shouldn't have even made that fucking gambling video. To be honest, there there was really no point in that. Like, literally just showing off gambling and stuff. It there was no point to it. That was just like a system you should just left in the dark. Like, what was the actual point of just putting that in there? Just to basically set yourselves on fire at that point. This fucker wouldn't have stood a chance in 2019 Xbox lobby. Oh my god, yeah. Yeah, people were really be talking mad shit. Like, <laughs> if anybody's got on there, uh, I don't think anybody would actually be afraid of today actually see him face to face. But, you know, then there's those guys who will still talk shit to your face, even if you do show up. So, yeah, you're, you're probably not going to get much out of that one. <laughs> Rip all Nintendo dogs who haven't been fed since oh, 2007. Oh, th thanks for putting that shit on my conscience because I used to have one. Oh, I don't even have my DS anymore, too. Yeah. He's dead. <laughs> thanks, thanks for putting that on my conscience. I, you know what? I might have to try and <laughs> I'm pretty sure I still have the game here somewhere. If I can figure out how to get the files onto my PC again and um, basically get an emulator, I could do that. 
you know, go back to him, see if he's still alive. Well, uh, no, that's not how it works because the game is actually saved to the actual DS. You know what? I'll probably just play it again, see if I can look up some stuff to it, see if we can actually take care of a dog for once. Feels bad, mate, and I hate you for this meme. Playing Skyrim for the story, not enough knowledge. Playing Skyrim for the dragon fight, you know, just almost there. Playing Skyrim for t to start a family. Wait, hold on. Who who did that? I, I don't think I went that far into Skyrim, to be honest. B but you know what? We're gonna use a bit more percentage of our brain for the family part. Playing Skyrim for werewolf anime titty mods. Oh, oh, that's just maximum brain power there. Now that I think about it. <laughs> I mean, Skyrim is fun with more mods. <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying. Any modded game is 10 times fun when you give the modding community tools. Give us the tools to mod and we'll create some pretty perfection stuff. And the Skyrim developers or Elder Scrolls developers know this is key to the most of their games because they gave it to us in Oblivion and we did tons of wonderful shit with Oblivion and then we did it with Skyrim and Skyrim's just going off the chart until Elder Scrolls 6 comes out and we don't know when that's going to be you know it was teased at E3 but you know where is more teasing because I, I need it because I, I can't wait for this new one because they make it way better than Skyrim to the point where I still don't ever complete the main mission and just travel off to a distant land I'm sold. <laughs> Garbage aim. Shitty internet. What the fuck? This game is broken. What a fucking hacker. I mean, I get a bit with my aim is garbage for sure. But shitty internet I don't have. But I do talk bad shit. <laughs> I, I definitely learned that from Smite. I, I've learned that from Smite all too well. That I talk a lot of mad shit, get shut down, and still talk a lot of mad shit later. <laughs> ah, the biggest war in gaming history right now. Wait, why is Rockstar there? Oh yeah, I forgot Rockstar makes games. Wait, why is Origin there? Isn't that owned by EA? Didn't he be off somewhere trying to make some money? Uh, I mean, uh, anyhow, um, <laughs> to be honest, I don't have... A problem with having like multiple launchers or anything like that or you know either way it goes my money's going to the devs I don't really give a fuck where I get my games from as long as I can still play them even if the launcher you know don't have any service or anything as long as I can still play my games I don't give a fuck <laughs> that's just me personally all right and with that said this concludes our video for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys actually enjoyed me reading Reddit memes, do leave a like and comment and tell me that you guys enjoyed and want more. I'll do it every now and then or you guys can give me a topic to look for on Reddit. Like I said, I'm pretty new to Reddit. I don't use it often or anything like that. But shit, if this, you know, gets a little bit more traction and People are actually enjoying it, and I might take a little bit more of a dazzle in it. But until then, I'll see you guys on the next one. I don't know why I just looked at my light over there. I now have a dot in front of my eye. This is an issue now. Until then, peace out.